Hello Tech World, this is Tech Thoughts. In this short video, we'll be discussing how to detect what FISMO roles are positioned on a domain controller, and then how to move those operation master roles using PowerShell to another domain controller that you specify. Primarily, we'll be discussing the git ad domain controller commandlet, as well as the move ad directory server operation master role commandlet. Let's go ahead and get started. So what I've got here is two domain controllers. I've got PDC2 and PDC. And I'm not sure which one contains which FISMO roles. So if I do a quick GM on git ad domain controller, one of the properties that I can pull is operation master roles. So note over here in my ISC that I have the git ad domain controller commandlet. I've specified which server I want to query. And I'll be just selecting just the operation master roles. Let's go ahead and run that command and see the results. This is going to be against PDC. And that returns all five FISMO roles. So all of my FISMO roles are currently positioned on PDC. Note that if I execute that same command on PDC2, that no results are returned. All right, since all my FISMO roles are over on PDC, I'll hop over there real fast. What I can do here is I can leverage the move AD directory server operation master role commandlet to move all those roles over to PDC2. Now I have to specify exactly which roles I want to move over and confirmation will be false. So we'll go ahead and execute this command. And it's already completed. Now you'll note that if I run this command again to get the AD domain controller to see what operation master roles are currently left on PDC, we get no results. And if I run that same command on PDC2, all five of my FISMO roles have moved over to that domain controller. So let's hop over to PDC2 real quick, and I'll show you that whereas before I specify the names of the actual FISMO roles, there are corresponding numbers for each of these, so we can specify 0 through 4. And each of these numbers corresponds to a FISMO role. You can look it up on TechNet. You can also consult the script we're going to discuss here in a minute to see which uh, numbers correspond with which role. And you'll notice that if I execute this and move everything back over to PDC, that it accepts those numbers just fine. Now if I execute the git ad domain controller, all my roles have successfully moved over to PDC. So we can greatly enhance those two command lists by wrapping this up into a script. I'm not going to spend a whole lot of time covering the details of this as it's a little bit complex. I suggest you check it out on the techthoughts.info website where you can find this script in its entirety as well as an associated write-up. But basically we'll be declaring some variables, we'll be prompting the user with some questions, We'll automatically detect which FISMO roles are installed on the domain controller. We'll allow the user to select which domain controller they would like to send those FISMO roles to. And then we'll convert those to numbers, the associated numbers. And then we'll transfer that for the user in an automated fashion. Let's go ahead and demo this script. And if you'd like more specifics, check out the write-up on techthoughts.info. So go ahead and click play. And the first thing it's going to ask us is, hey, I noticed that you're running this on PDC Arc Local. Is that correct? And then we'll go ahead and say yes, because that is the DC that we're on. And it's like, hey, I'm not going to do anything for you because this DC has no FISMO roles. So let's go ahead and execute that on PDC. It's going to ask us the same question. I noticed you're running on PDC. Does that look good to you? It says, hey, the available domain controllers in your environment are PDC2 that you could possibly transfer these roles to. If you had you know, 10 or 12 other domain controllers in your environment, it, the script will list those as well. And it'll allow you to select via number which domain controller you would like to transfer those FISMO roles to. So we'll go ahead and select one since that corresponds with PDC2 and click enter. It moved the roles over for us and did another check. And it says, good, this DC no longer has any FISMO roles. So this is just a short example of how you can utilize these two commandlets in a script to kind of add some diverse functionality for moving FISMO roles around. I hope you enjoyed this short video on detecting where FISMO roles are positioned using the git ad domain controller commandlet, as well as moving those between domain controllers using the move ad directory server operation master role commandlet. Make sure to check out the corresponding write-up on techthoughts.info.